Autumn and the living is easy. We've finished up summer, at least in our minds, moving on to maybe a final fishing trip before hanging it up. Sherry Maddock at Lake Wallapompax sent this. But the last few days have invited us outside to see remarkable sights. Here's one from Doris Osborne, Halstead. From Fred at Bury's Lake, the sun peeking through the trees, waving a flag, as it were, to invite us out. At Lake Sheridan from Al Trittino, evening is here. Evening, settling in here from Rebecca Bordner at the Schwartz Farms, Higgins. The sky was lit by a blazing fire that covered whatever it came to. From Dave at Hazleton, a football game. Sunset in Pensdale from Tim Tyler in Muncie. Fire in the sky, sunset at Penn's Peak in Jim Thorpe from Pam Storm. A familiar sight, backlit by a fiery sky, is from Carol de Leon Nicholson. Each way we turned in an evening, there was color, bright, rich color, as here from Monica Marzani, Newton Township. Sunset on the Hill, a capture by Tim Tyler, Montoursville. There is something to bind us to each season of the year. The autumn leaves for sure, and now something else. One example here at Crystal Lake from Robert Jones of Voca. Sunset on the Susquehanna from Lana G of Pittston. Another view of the Susquehanna during a fall sunset sent in by Stacy Osadchi Wapolopin. From Carbondale comes our final image, courtesy Leslie Engelmeyer. The end of another day brought to us by nature on a stage called autumn. Let's hope the curtain goes up again soon. I'm Mike Stevens in the Photo Link Library.